Hey y'all, Val Sunshine here from Crypto Shift Group, and I'm going to show you how to swap your OAP tokens for your Etherlite. I'm here doing it on the MetaMask browser. This is for iPhone users. If you're an Android user, I do not recommend that you try this. I have a clear phone. I attempted it, and it did not successfully go through. But I'm still going to show you the steps because it allows me to get all the way to the end. So what you need to do is you need to be in the wallet of the account with the OAP that you're going to be doing. This account, I have multiple Open Alexa accounts, and so I used them all in the Trust Wallet. I did all the swaps over there. This is a demo, um, or just have a couple of OAPs here. I gave the rest to my friend that got hacked. So I'm here, I'm gonna go into the top left. You have to have Ethereum too. If you don't have a few dollars of Ethereum, you cannot do the transaction. You're on the Ethereum blockchain, so you have to pay gas fees. You don't have any gas fees, you're not going to get from point A to point B. So we're going to go up to the menu in the top left and go to the browser. And right here where it says search and type URL, you're going to type in swap.openalexa.com. Okay, dot com. And then it's going to connect to the wallet that you're using. So if you click the circle up in the top right corner, you can see you're connected. If you only have one wallet, you're definitely connected. So it will show here that I have the two OAP. So I would just tap here and I would type two. If you're on the wrong network, if you're on the Ethereum uh, Etherlite mainnet, it won't, it won't do it for you. It'll tell you you're on the wrong network. So I'll click transfer. And here you get 30 ether lights per OAP for the next seven months. Okay, so anytime that you want to do your swap OAP to ether light, it's always going to be 210, but this is going to be for a series of seven months. So, and you can only do it one time per wallet, per wallet address. You can only do it once. You cannot, you know, I couldn't do one out of this one and then come back and do one out of this one. I have to do two at the same time or whatever's left in the wallet that you don't use, you need to put it in another wallet. All right, so I click continue. And then here's where some of the hang up has been with the gas fees um, through the wallets. So here it's gonna show that the gas fee is $1.22. It's not much, I'll tell you, it's a couple dollars. So you tap on the dark blue underlined here where it shows how many ETH. And then you will wanna click on fast. Definitely wanna click on fast. You can click on advanced if you know about uh, gas fees at all. You have to have enough gas to get through the transaction and you can check the gas um, numbers on gasnow.org or um, etherscan.io forward slash gas tracker and just see it will have a slow, standard, fast, rapid, you know, so you want to go accordingly. Um, so this one, what I'm showing right now on gas now, it shows that it's 14. This one says 13. So I would just put it at 14 and I would click save. So it says insufficient funds for me. So that's what, um, but I would click save and I have the Ethereum, you saw it there. It just is, it's, I can't do it because I'm not letting me with my phone. Um, so then I would just click confirm. And then once that happens, you will go back to this page here. It will have a circle, not that. But it will have a circle here like it's going, you know, that it's working itself. You don't have to stay on this page. Once you see that circle start going, it'll have an 8 on it because it's going to go all the way through the blockchain. You can leave this screen. It's already in process right away. You'll just go back over to your wallet. And instead of being on the Ethereum main network, now you need to go over and click on the Etherlite main network. If you have not added the Etherlite main network, there's a link in the description here that you'll need to do that um, in order to uh, have your tokens show up. So they'll be right here as soon as the transaction's done. So you'll, you can't see your Ethereum and your Etherlite in the same wallet because they're on different networks and you cannot see your Etherlite in Trust Wallet or anywhere else. You can only see them here right now. So they'll be here and this is where um, you can come and check. It shouldn't take very long once you do the transaction when you put it on fast. It should only, not, not even more than a couple minutes. All right, if you guys need any help, let me know. Uh, please give this video a like, subscribe to my channel. I'm always here to help you guys learn your way through these things. 
got the Twitter and the Telegram and the Facebook crypto groups and uh, we've got mentorship for coaching for crypto and I also offer one-on-one. -on -one. So let me know if I can help in any way. Thanks guys for your support. Let me know if I can help. Take care.